we have uh, described it as a fascist piece of legislation that will completely disable the media from doing its work and it will completely suffocate us. I don't see how as journalists we are going to work if this law is passed. As you know, it bans foreign correspondents from reporting in Zimbabwe. It puts journalists in Zimbabwe on a one-year licensing system. And you and I know very well that uh, we are not going to get those licenses from uh, the Minister of Information, whose hatred for private media journalists is an open secret. It will also stop us from reporting on the proceedings of cabinet and from reporting on the activities of crucial government departments. Including a controversial bill to control the foreign and domestic press and a security bill that will out... It's the Mugabe government's efforts to close down the press, both foreign and domestic, plain and simple. They don't want a critical press, they don't want a critical overseas press, and so they're trying to stop it. I think everybody's determined to keep working, not only of the foreign correspondents, but also of the, the local press. And uh, they, they want to keep on working. They feel that the law is unconstitutional, it's illegitimate, and also it's futile. Uh, in this day and age of, of the internet, of email, of, of faxing, to try and stop the flow of information, it's like trying to stop the sun from rising in the morning. It's, it's impossible. This is all. I suspect that uh, there is uh, going to be a lot of debate on it. Uh, whether or not there will be division on it, uh, that I can't tell. But I certainly think that there will be heated debate over the subject.